Hey guys and welcome back to another new Animal Crossing video, I'm Crossing Channel and today we're going to be visiting a really beautiful desert oasis island that I visited live on stream a few days ago. This one is really incredible and I think you guys will enjoy it a lot. So if you're excited for this video be sure to leave a like, show your support and let's get straight into this. Okay, so this one's called New Bark and I've heard things about this one. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh, it's Nook's Cranny? Oh yeah, this is the one. This is definitely the one. Okay. This is, uh... This is the desert island. How do we get in here? Can I go around? Yeah, I can, I think. Oh, oh my god, look at this. Whoa. Hmm, I'm a bit stuck. Alright, here we go. I want to get the, uh, items to wear. First of all. Yeah, here we go. Alright, I'm ready, guys. This is the desert island. It's like a tropical oasis. I'm very excited. Here we go. Oh my lord, we can get all dressed up for this one. Very exciting. Okay, here we go. I'm still wearing a backpack, but that's fine. Oh my god. Oh, whoa. I need to like take a picture here real quick, guys. I need to take a picture here. I gotta do it. Hang on, wait. There we go. Whoa, this is like... So much to take in at once, you know? But it's cool. Oh my god, there's the desert, guys. You know, it reminds me of, um... Yo, Ch Chief, come back! Guys, he's gonna get lost, and he's gonna... Yo, 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 Look at the stuff in the distance. Look at the stuff in the distance. It really reminds me of, like, Zelda. You know, when you go out into the desert in Breath of the Wild? Oh, my God. That's what... That's the vibes I'm getting right now. Yo, the map. Let's check out the map. <laughs> it's even got its own oasis, guys. Oh, man. I am... I'm dying for this one. I'm dying for this one. This one is so cool. I love when people really commit to a theme for their islands, you know? That's, like, really impressive to me. Whoa. And all the different stalls, like, the markets and stuff to make their own little town with it. It just works so well. You've got to have a lot of creativity to do something like this. For me, personally, I'd never be able to commit so much to one theme. I always get excited about different ideas. Gerudo Town Vibes, yes. That's exactly what I was thinking. Really, really cool. Makes me want to replay Breath of the Wild right now, to be honest. But yeah, this is so cool. Like, I wouldn't have even thought you could make a desert island in this game with the items that are available, but you really can. It actually works so much better than I ever thought would be possible. Wow. Just look at this, though. Oh, my God. And then we, like, go out into the desert. And it's, like, it's so simple, yet it works perfectly. Dream on, little dreamer. I will. It, like, they can, like, get away with making this as simple as it is, you know, because it's a desert. It's like a desert. It's an empty desert. So they don't need to have this be complicated. I think maybe if they had a few more things out here, that'd be cool. But honestly, even just seeing this view... With, like, the clouds going over and stuff is really neat. This is cool. Stuff like this, like, really like. Because it just helps, like... Oh, man. Hey. Welcome. The merchant. They're ants, guys. They've really thought of, like, every little detail here to make this work. Socks with sandals. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, um... Oh... You know what, guys? I just want to, like, take a moment to be sincere for a second. This game, Animal Crossing New Horizons, it gets a lot of... You know, a lot of people were disappointed with it, because it didn't have everything we wanted, it's missing items, it's missing features and stuff, and that's totally understandable, and I feel that way myself often. But when I see stuff like this, it really makes me just realize just how incredible this game actually is. And how special this game is compared to other Animal Crossing games. You know, 
we don't always have to think about whether an island is better or worse or whatever, you know? Um, sorry, we don't have to think about whether an Animal Crossing game is better or worse and compare them all the time. I think we can just look at islands like this and, and think to ourselves, like, okay, this is amazing on its own, you know? We don't have to look at it and think, okay, is this better than New Leaf? Is this worse than New Leaf? Is it worse than City Folk better? We don't have to think like that. We can just look at what we're seeing and, and think, this is really great. And that's just what I wanted to say. I'm, I'm very impressed with this island. Just such a great job. If this game does one thing right, really right, it's that it allows players to be very creative and that's that's wonderful. It's just so nice. Lovely little market area out in the sand, you know. Maybe you would find some shady wares here. Which I kind of like. I like I have my own kind of shady market on my island, so this is giving me lots of inspiration. But look at the view as you look out to it. This this is a beautiful game, guys, it really is. I kind of feel like this island would be cool at night as well. But the sunset works really well. Oh man. Alright, we're gonna see if we can find the oasis, guys. Hello? Oh, how did you get all the way down here? I don't know. Yo. Oh, they don't want you coming in. Nope, something is something bad's going on in there. We're gonna keep away. Where's the oasis? Oh my god, here it is. Is this the oasis? I think it is. This looks like the oasis. Can we get in? It's kind of tricky to get in. Let's see if we can maybe rest our way around. Uh, nope. I'm trying. Lots to navigate here, but that's very cool. Okay. Yeah, this is so nice. Beautiful little oasis, you know? And when I say oasis, I don't mean today is gonna be the day that the <laughs> You know what I don't like? I don't like when islands kind of hide away the museum and they make it so you can't access the museum. Like, I get that the museum doesn't always fit with your island, but I love that they've still incorporated it, you know? I, I'm proud of them. Good job. Incredible job overall. I love this island. This was a really great, really great island. And they should feel very proud of themselves, I think. Be sure to join us on Discord to continue the discussion and chat with a whole bunch of other Animal Crossing fans. I want to give a big thanks to my channel members who support this channel every month and they get a whole bunch of cool perks for doing so, so if you want to become a channel member, click the join button down below the video to learn more.